Hi everybody, I'm Keiko Agena and I'll be reading a story from Marvel Superhero Adventures, Spider Sense of Adventure, and the story is called Spidey Bugs Out. So it's about Spider-Man and probably some bugs, I'm guessing. So we start on a washing machine, pretty normal. And what looks like a little bit of a board, Peter Parker, he's like, sigh, swish, swish, and then, we hear, I'm Spider-Man. Whoa, Peter Parker goes back. And there's a little kid with a Spider-Man mask on that's running through. And a mom that says, sorry about him. Peter Parker goes, oh, it's fine. <laughs> I didn't want to stand there anyway. There's a much better place to stand. Peter's always accommodating, it seems. She says, uh-huh, are you done with that dryer? Oops, yeah, sorry about that. I'll get these out of your way. She goes, uh-huh. I think I got hypnotized by the washing machine, which will happen. And then as he's gathering up all of his laundry, we hear on the television, But Bobby, how will I ever know who ate my yogurt? It's interrupted by another news program. Good evening. We interrupt this soap opera to bring you breaking news. The eSports Stadium currently hosting the World Championship for the top title in Bubble Knot 3, a sold out event. And we see that there are people scrambling out of the arena. And the newscaster is saying, is currently under attack by a villain calling herself the Beatle. Authorities have been contacted and are on their way. But before she can even finish, Spider-Man is zipping out into the street. She continues, We just hope that the contestants can remain safe until then. Meanwhile, there's a woman. She looks pretty dangerous already. She's got her fists in the air. She says, <laughs> Nothing and no one can stop the Beatle. I designed this suit, and it looks fabulous, by the way, after the second strongest Beatle in the world. Now the gamers have not stopped playing, by the way, and they say, dude, only the second strongest? One of the other gamers said, wow, she's playing. So what beetle is the strongest then? <sighs> the dung beetle. They can lift a thousand times their body weight. Yo, that's neat. I guess they gotta be that strong to push elephant doodoo up a hill, says the gamer acutely. I understand not wanting your brand to be good at doo-doo rolling though, says the gamer, which is a good point because when you're a super villain, you gotta think about branding. Although this is not what the Beatle really wants to talk about, I feel like, because she says, anyway, as I was saying, she's trying to get them back on track. I'll be taking the grand prize now. A state-of-the-art supercomputer being used as a gaming PC is frankly offensive to me. She doesn't like gamers, guys. When I heard it was the prize for a gaming tournament, I couldn't believe my luck. She's marching towards the supercomputer. The gamers don't seem to notice. And she literally says, I could walk right in as I've done and steal your supercomputer as I'm doing. But you'd all be too weak to fight the Beatle. I mean, gamers, <laughs> don't you lot hang out in basements all day. He goes, uh, that's a stereotype? And she says, yeah, we hang out and live streams all day. Clarification. But it doesn't matter because the Beatle is already at the supercomputer. And she says, be that as it may, this supercomputer is mine now. And she rips the cords out of the supercomputer. Not cool, not cool. You think because I'm a gamer that I won't fight some bug nerd who settles for being the second best beetle? Because lady, I will roll your doo-doo head up both ways. <sighs> that catches her attention. Do I hear a challenge in that? Her wings just pop out of her back. That would certainly make things more interesting. And then we see both of them locked in battle. They're ready. But from the side we hear, nope. Webs hit the beetle on, on her head and on her back. It says, no, 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 no. And there's webs, there's a whole web wall and the beetle goes flying out to the side. And he says, no. Spider-Man has arrived on the scene. With the web wall already up, he says, are you guys okay? Anyone hurt? 
And the gamers kind of chill. They're like, hey, Spider-Man. Uh, he's like, hey, so the exit is clear now. If you want to be Spider-Man. He's like, um, hi again. He's doing a lot of introductions here. So the exit is clear now. He hears another person say, Spider-Man. Yes? See, he thinks it's another gamer, like another fan. So he's real casual like when he turns and he says, hi there. And wait, no, you're the bad guy. Okay, uh, I see what just happened there. Ouch. I don't know what these bug beetles are doing, but they're probably biting him. And she says, nothing. And no one will stop the beetle. I modeled this tech after the second strongest beetle in the world. <laughs> Spider-Man is also surprised by this. He says, second strongest? As he swings up and throws off some of these little beetle bugs. What's the... And the gamers say, dung beetle. Little dudes can lift a thousand times their body weight. He's thinking, huh, that's neat. That's neat. But while he's distracted, oof, he gets knocked in the head because he wasn't protecting himself at all. He says, oof, falls to the ground. Another gamer goes, Spider-Man. He's like, oh, the ground, hey, buddy. Says, I fixed the computer. Spider-Man, as he gets back into action, says, what, what are you guys still doing here? It's too dangerous. He thought he let them out of the way, but these guys are real focused, you know? And all of them are back on the computer while they're tap, 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 tapping away. From off screen, we hear a pow, wham, thud, ow. And the gamers say, anyone who leaves forfeits the tournament. And none of us are willing to do that. This right, Spider Man's fighting the beetle, and he says, uh, I think so. They're like, Thanks, man, it's a world championship, you know how it is. I don't know if this is gonna work, guys, because in the next panel, she's busting out. She says, uh, ha, 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 Nothing, and no, Spider Man goes, Wait, 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 how can you even escape my webbing? She says, Spider webs are no match for beetles, we always fly out of them. Fly, you say, Got it. What? I didn't stop that. No, you stop, says Spider-Man. You stop first. In fact, you can't hurt anybody if you're grounded. And she falls to the ground, her foot up in the air. And Spider-Man with his hands up in the air. I think he's won the day at this point. She says, Ugh, it's a design flaw. I needed the power of that supercomputer to improve the performance of my beetle suit. Spider-Man says, then I'm glad I was able to stop you from stealing it because with great processing power comes great performance capability. <laughs> That's Spider-Man. So later, we're back at the laundromat. Peter Parker picks up a little note, the one he wrote earlier that said BRB, be right back. And his smiley face is crossed out and then somebody has drawn in a uh, brownie face. His laundry is piled up high. Maybe he left another dryer full of laundry. In any case, I don't think people are too happy with him at this point. He looks pretty sad. He says, and with great responsibility comes great laundry. Seriously so much laundry. But then on that same television that we heard earlier, we hear, This just in. The Beatles' attempted burglary was bungled earlier today. Lucky for these gamers that Spider-Man arrived to detain the Beatle before anyone was injured. Tell us, how did you feel during all this? Were you scared? The gamer, he said, No, not with Spider-Man there. He had things under control the whole time. I love Spider-Man. That's the kind of confidence that Spider-Man gives people. Aww. The announcer says, Well, congrats again on your big tournament win today. Thanks, dude. It was all because Spider-Man had our backs. That he did. Well, you know what I really liked about that story? It's that sometimes we can all get a little bit down in the dumps and think that no one appreciates what we do. But you know what? I bet there is someone out there appreciating you right now. And you might not even know it. Just like Peter Parker. Thanks everybody. Stay tuned for more Marvel Read.